question number 23, the same as 12A, question number 17. So here we have a triangle of a 3, 5, 3, 4, 5 triangle again, right? So the hypotenuse has to be 5. And what are we looking for? Okay, so this question saying the small square at this corner, the small square at this corner, um, we don't know the shape. Okay, we, no, we don't know the, the size. Okay, we know the shape is square. We don't know the size. And from this tip, you have a perpendicular line to the hypotenuse and the lens is 2. Just remember, okay, this, this um, segment 2 is not on the same line as the diagonal of the small square x. Okay, so we cannot say uh, the diagonal here plus the 2. Okay, we cannot say that. So, so how do we find out? Okay, what we want to know is the, the uh, fraction of fields planted. So planted part is just the, the part that not in the small square. So what we want to find out what the fraction of the field, okay? So let's see what is the best way to do this, uh, to do this area problem, okay? So let's find out. If we, if we break this up, if we break this whole field up into small pieces like that, from the tip of the uh, square, connect with the vertices of these uh, those two vertices. So, and then also connect the diagonal of the square. So let's look at the three smaller triangles. Okay. So first of all, the the part here, this triangle, the triangle, the the triangle, the one side of the triangle is and the perpendicular line is actually the side length of the square, small square. So how about we give it a, uh, make this x, okay? Make this x. The square, uh, x, is a, uh, x is the side length of the square. So in this case, the triangle, uh, the orange part, and I uh, marked the orange, this triangle area is a, uh, uh, 3 times x over 2, 3x over 2, okay. So this is the area of the, uh, that triangle. And then let's calculate the other small triangle. The other small triangle is this part. The side length of this one is 4, and also the, the altitude is also x, okay. So let me add, add it up. So plus, plus, 4x over 2. And then we add another one is the bigger part of the triangle. This triangle, we know that the, the base is 5, and then the altitude is 2. So, okay, so we just add it up. 5 times 2 over, 5 times 2 over 2. And the three triangle add together is the whole triangle, the big triangle. The big triangle is a Right triangle is just three and four, right? So three times four over two. Now we have an equation of x. Okay, so let's solve it. Let's solve it. So in this case, we have uh, seven over two x plus oops, seven over two. Seven over two x plus uh, uh, five times two over two is five equals six. So x seven over two x is 1. So x equals to 2 over 7. Now we have the side length of the square is 2 over 7. Now what we need to do is calculate uh, the, uh, the square. Okay, we calculate the, the, the area of the small square. So the area of square is equal to area of s is equal to 4 over 49. So so what we want is uh, we want the, the the part that is planted. So the actual the actual result is supposed to be six minus four over forty nine divided by six. Okay. So it's easier to calculate four over forty nine divided by six first. So let's calculate that four over forty nine. 
And if I have a six, we're just multiplying the six on the denominator. So it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be three here and a two on the top. So that give us two over one forty seven. And then the final answer should be one minus that, right? One minus that, so it's equal to one forty five over one forty seven, which is answer B.